Uh, hello everyone, it's WooTBM and Jabroni Tony again. We got another wheel, we got another bunch of games that we're just gonna play. We're just gonna spin this wheel and uh, I guess we're gonna try out maybe five games or something. We'll see how this goes. Let's see what it gives us. Oh wow, off the bat we get this weirdo. Vigo Mortison? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's open this up. Alright, so I did want to mention... Uh, Talk about this guy just a little bit because this guy is uh he's got very weird games i might remove all of his games i added like all of them onto the wheel because he's, they all have demos he's got 3d mod he's got he's just oh got a God. lot of weird crap going on in his game um, every possible thing we run yeah and look at this two user reviews but look at this guy he is just like determined like he has so many games he just 30 dollars yeah he's a 30 dollar oh, game in the top Oh wow! Oh, the soundtrack. Oh, soundtrack. Oh, okay. What the hell? Why is it more expensive than the game? This makes. But yeah, he's Zilcho just. Sense arena. But yeah, he's just constantly releasing games every few months, and. Uh, Do any of them sell? I wonder. Yeah, it seems like none of them sell. So I don't know what his how he keeps going. <laughs> how does he afford to do this? I guess this is his first game. Only two years ago, and now he has like. Uh, however many games this is, is crazy. Some of them aren't RPG Maker, but obviously I went for the RPG Maker ones. But, uh... Yeah, let's, uh... Download whatever this is and maybe try him and never try him again. Yes. <laughs> that, yeah, exactly. Get lost in the annals of... of Steam. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, it's so fast. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I just. I'm seeing your Steam page. Okay, let's, let's. Let's see if I can. Now that we're all set up here, uh, I'm gonna hit restart on this because this this is incredible. I press. You press play on the game, and this is what happens. All right, let's see. Whoa! Whoa! In 2022, the, the United Nations discovered another world in this world of powerful creatures that could speak. Oh my God! Like, there's no way you could. Like, <laughs> this is so fast. Is a very unreasonable speed of reading. Oh, I wonder if this person has the uh, bu the bug where they've used whatever that plugin is that makes the game run at a faster speed because you're on a fast monitor. Oh. <laughs> All right, you ready with that timer? Yes. All right. It says waz to move and space to interact. Well, he's got wazed, so. All right, I'm hitting. I'm hitting start on timer. So. Good for okay. him. Go full full screen there. It wasn't fully full screen. All right. Oh, I can move. I was facing oh a wall. My God. So we got this 3D mod again. Okay, those don't do anything. Hello, default assets. <laughs> do you want to exit the game? What? But I can what do this. Clip. Oh my God. Harold. It's. it's why did he not change his name? Harold's the default name. Oh, okay. <laughs> what the hell is this? Why is it playing again? Was this game free or discharged? Uh, this is not free. I am playing the demo. Oh, okay. Well, but is... apparently opening the menu restarts the game, which is very weird. I don't know why that would ever be the case. Everyone's got black eyeliner. I like it. <laughs> Oh, wow, that's... Okay. Sure, somebody will play New Game Plus. Sure. Always dash on, command remember on. Render distance, 25. Oh, the music didn't loop properly. Oh, no! <laughs> Why does this happen? What the hell? I've never played a game, RPG Maker game, where that happens. I don't know how he screwed that up. All right, well, I guess we'll just... So what is it? You open the menu and it restarts the game? Yeah. That's so crazy. Start a new game? Whoa. Hey, you're already... It just puts you in. Yeah, he's just... You just whoa. I'm doing the driving thing from Dragon Paw. All right. We're I see the mini-map. Oh, okay. Okay. Eve. Okay. Harlod? Wow. I don't know if that's an intentional typo or not. <laughs> he doesn't care oh, about yeah. your name. Yeah. Nope. 
got mini map. But you already had the mini map. Yeah. What a liar. Okay. Oh, you can speed it up and slow it down. Yeah. This one's actually a reasonable speed, so the first one must be just stupidity. Yeah, Crystal. Crystal. He missed a random typo. Oh, There's no. more to come. 3D mod. 3D mod. All these people making games in the 3D mod is just a way to be like, look, it's not RPG Maker. Yeah. Okay, you've made several games by now. I would hope you would patch your games at some point. I like that Crystal's shadow is just part of its asset. What the hell? Yeah, orientation was spelled wrong as well. <laughs> so. Inch, 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 inch. Don't believe us? Hear our employees talk. Okay. I get this is supposed to be comedic, but there hasn't been enough contextual establishment yeah. for us to really care about what Addy is. Okay, this is dumb. Yeah, how long is this gonna go? Hopefully, one or two more slides. Why do you choose these colors? I think this is, my guess is that's some, maybe it's a, a fill-in parody HR semi thingy. Like a, it's a, a template for a parody HR video. <laughs> yeah. I'm just hoping it's, it's not some somewhere. sort of weird reference to Ukraine. Oh, I see. Oh. That's their flag. Yep. Uh, let me get your equipment. Yes, give me. Collect demons to sell to us. Kill any major targets. We don't know much about this world. It has creatures like demons. Most tech doesn't work. Except mazes. Mazes, you say? Alright. Since there's mazes, I feel like I don't... I think receive is spelled wrong. Fuckers. Oh, he said the F word. Continues uh -oh. messed up. Yeah, it's just... Content continued. And who thought this like this 3D mod going? Hey, look how big these pixels are. Is is a good idea? I know it's supposed to be. Oh, but it's a it's a reference to old games. But Jesus, it's yeah. It's Did I get equipment? Looking. Okay. You reference have... old first person games. Do it. You know, do the old ones like by the beholder. Don't don't do this weird JRPG hybrid that looks really bad. Oh no, these don't look... These don't look like Save. good things. Game end. I have default equipment. Is this just talking to people to tell you about stuff? What is the... Yeah, I've had enough talking. Let's fight demons like none of this matters. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, can I? <gasps> There's a strafe button! Whoa. Oh, okay, oh, wow. And Tin New Ting keeps putting an actually an extra T. Just mash through these guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, are you gonna tell me something important? Is this you literally forcing me to like listen to this lore? I thought it was gonna be like some sort of important tutorialization. Oh man, running down this hallway. Excite oh my god, what the hell is going on? Marina Salia, I made the welcoming event. It was kinda shit. Is the first default choice. How funny. Self kinda rude. Yomina support. As long as you are not dumb. Uh huh. Buying and selling news. Yeah. Nuke nuclear heads. Don't fuck this up. Yeesh. Yes. Don't ruin a human demon by being <laughs> Okay. Edgy man. It's reminding me of uh was it Frank Miller? This Batman is like, what are you retarded? Don't you know I'm Batman? <laughs> like, so edgy. So edgy. Alright, I guess I'll save because that was a lot of hallways I had to God, walk through. These 2D assets are not meant to be seen from a 3D perspective. No. A lot of their shadows are like hovering under in the air above them, under them, next to them. Oh, we've got random encounters. Oh. These, these, uh. Oh, look at this. Squatting. There's an auto fighting. 
I died instantly. Um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I can like, retry battle. Oh, that's good. The only exception I can think of is there was those four statues in one of the earlier rooms. I wonder if you're supposed to talk to them and get stuff. Oh, here oh, we go. Oh, maybe. I'm gonna do this. Maybe this will make a difference. Yeah, that was my best. Their shield. Oh, now you're dead. 1400 damage. Okay, my guess is go back to the shield, and if that doesn't lead anything, then, you know, whatever. <laughs> yeah, what? What did she say? How am I. Okay. Don't fuck this job. Support us. So. Okay. Okay. Oh, am I supposed to talk to these guys? Money from selling is based on their XP. Why can't you spell there correctly? Please. Yeah, this has the whole... It's not a. It's not even a typo. He just legit doesn't know how to spell certain words. Like in yeah, he just keeps doing it wrong. He spells solider instead of soldier. Jesus. Um. So am I supposed to do something? Like. Okay, Go back to those shields. Can't That's talk all I got. This. Maybe I was supposed to talk to those guys somehow. I assume because it was combat, that was, you know, random and not like a guy I walked into. Yeah. So I can't interact with any of these. So I can't get better equipment. It seems like. So, say so there are statues like two rooms back. Those are the ones I'm thinking of. I don't think they're gonna do anything, but I mean that's the last oh. one we got. Well, we'll just, just go for here, and it would have, would have, if it happens again, then we'll try that in and out by the end of this. Oh, here's a guy. I talked to him. Uh huh. Save uh, often. Okay, well. Because of pad game design. Saving's not gonna save me from. Oh my god. People who do models. 1,400 damage when I only have 200 health. Um, yeah. I don't know, just auto. Like, I don't have moves. Dead. Probably dead? Let's see. Yep. Yep, 684 wow, damage. Okay. Okay. Last thing you got. Yeah, just did the... Just try to do some of the statues. That's that's the only thing I think. It's like yeah. two rooms back, so you gotta go a bit back. If you can go back, it might even block you. Yeah, we'll see. I go pretty fast, which is good, because he made these rooms way too fucking big. Yep. I'll strafe the power of strafe. Alright, yeah, here these we go. Things. I love these things. Okay. Oh, they're all the same thing. Oh, I see. Okay, I think it's just... Just nothing. If you're not I'd like retarded. to. I'd like to think that... This guy actually tested his game and... <laughs> the, the 200 health and 700 damage is not... Like, there's something they were supposed to do that we're not, but regardless, this game doesn't really deserve the attention. Yeah. To figure it out. And then, it's very possible there just isn't a solution to this game, which is never tested, so... Yeah. Uh, I'll try to look for a talk option. I don't think there is one, but I'll try to find one, because they mentioned something about talking to the demons. Alright. Um, well, there's escape. No. There's no... Uh, oh, okay, let's do that. Okay, you're gonna... 50% chance. Oh. oh, I got all of them! What? Okay. 700 XP! Are you level? Axe found. <laughs> I leveled four Five. times?! Wow. Oh, so, so, so your monsters are... So save, and then yeah, your monsters are your guys. Okay, they only gave me nine hit points, so... Yeah, you got nine... You got, you got what, that two, almost... That's two per level. Excellent. This axe I got isn't better? Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Uh, can he? He can't wear things. All right. You're still gonna so. get one shot too. That's the best part. That's Dangerous great. Gonna get one shot too. Oh wow, potion! Save. Great. It's one oh, of these games save. where you yeah. get potions from chests. Great. That probably, probably heal 100 HP. Yeah. This is the default amount, probably. It's, 500. Oh. Okay. Oh, recovers. Recovers. Um, apparently I went upstairs. I don't know if that's a good idea. Oh, okay, well, I'm stuck here now. So, oh, hello. I can talk to you. Yes. Very informative. 
Uh huh. <laughs> okay. Kill the beast and return the book. Okay, that's very descriptive. So I can't possibly defeat these guys still. Um, capture him. I have to capture him. It's the yeah, only option I have. That's probably how you build your party. You capture everything at the start and then... Oh, he can use it too. I don't know if he thought about this. No effect. Uh, it says 50%. Oh. Yeah. I got two guys, so each guy... 1,500? Level 7? Wow. Alright. So... So they're getting pretty strong, but I'm weak as hell still. They yep. still can't survive a hit from those guys that do like <laughs> 1,500 damage, but... They cannot. I mean, unless my defense is like getting way, way, way higher. I haven't been looking at that. Oh my god. Like, literally the only way to fight these guys is to use these damn capture cards. It's the only way. There's no way I can defeat them. Yes. Oh yeah, 100%. This is this game is all capture card until... Oh, he attacked. Why did he attack? Oh, okay, dead. Start killing your party, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's all capture card until you get a full party and then that blows. Is yeah. Absolutely what it is. Wow. What game design? We're pretty much out of time. We got a minute left, so it's up to you. Alright, let's it. retry this battle. I gotta get the skeleton. They're so cool. I don't know why it attacked. Huh? Oh, because they've never taken his turn before. I was just mashing spacebar. No effect. Come on, it's 50% chance. 50% chance. No, we lose again. <laughs> That's all it takes. What game design? Well, I guess that's it. I guess we're dead. I guess we're losers. Because we weren't willing to flip a coin and save scum until we get strong enough to actually fight things. <laughs> Excellent design. Money uh, for this game. Money. Yeah, how much did this game cost again? I don't uh, know. It says $15. That's insanity. Hopefully there's zero sales. What are the reviews on here? Negative. One of the most baffling examples of how not to make an RPG. Yes. Wait, it has it actually has reviews versus zero? That's impressive. Yeah. Somehow. And this Maybe person got a, this person got a crash. Wow. Well, there's actually more than two reviews. There's four. Wow. I hope these people refunded this garbage. <laughs> $15 for this. Nothing like taking clip art and just coloring it a solid red or blue for 80% of creatures. Combat, however, someone the worst. Someone give it a thumbs up. No. Combat is, however, the worst I've seen in a game ever. Regular mook enemies encounters vary between a single enemy that you could, you and your collective creatures wail on, or having to deal with around seven to ten bloated turn orders of enemies that just mass heal, buff each other all the time while likely deal. Fifty percent of healing is for that. Uh, of my creatures to avoid instant death. I'd only be able to save one before literally instant death, but combat is virtually pointless and you just spam the very cheap monster cards to capture and creatures instantly ending the battle and still rewarding with XP and money to buy yet again more capture cards. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's what I was trying to figure out. I was like, did somebody figure out how to like not die instantly? Let's see if this person who gave it a positive review. <laughs> 20 hours on file. Yeah, wow. Getting all the endings on this game after many hours, I think it's worth the price. Really? Side with you can capture enemies, fight for you, side you can. I mean you have to. Like this is the only way to fucking win at the beginning. Uh oops. The maze in this game isn't as bad to navigate compared to the Legend of Azarius. Okay. Not being the worst maze ever. I love that logic. It's not the worst thing ever, so it's not bad. No. How low are the standards? <laughs> <laughs> All right. What is this game called again? Via Mortis. All right. If you have an idea what you're gonna grade, let's uh, let's write this like three three D mod. In coin flip, either either you win and get party members or die instantly. 
I'm trying to think if I'm like going off Ballad of Radol. And I, at first, I was like, this this isn't Ballad of Radol's own special class is bad, but I was like, this is not that far above it. Yeah. Tons of un, you know, just. I'm mean, Ballad of Radol, at least you could fight. You know, it's. Because the 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 design is just as is you know lots of grammar lots of little things that make no sense and then the gameplay is yeah just a raw 50 50 i almost feel like it doesn't deserve and then it's 15 dollars. yeah i think that the, the, that was the thing that pushed me into f minus minus thinking about the 15 dollars. like that's insane yeah i'll, I'll do the same F-. <laughs> it's like it's crazy yeah uh i can't believe people didn't refund the game honest i can't believe they, they played it enough to give it a thumbs down and then not be able to refund it yeah Wow. Great. This is this game is pretty much unplayable. Pretty amazing. All right, let's see what we get for the next one. No, I can't. I can't see the wheel. I'll just trust your trust you on the wheel. Okay. Beyond reality. This is one of the ones where I considered removing it. <laughs> so we might cut this one short. Okay. Because it might just be just regular old RPG Maker and nothing funny. To experience excellence nothing funny or bad or good just just, just rpg maker shit garbage all right <laughs> okay so yeah one of the things i was removed when i was removing games uh i you know if the game is vx ace or earlier i was like eh remove it <laughs> yeah well, but think, now somehow this guy sneaks through yeah i guess i kept this one on because it's sci-fi so it's not the default stuff but I think we're mm-hmm. gonna get default RPG makers. That's why I'm like, sure. All right. May- Starting maybe I'll end timer. Up. Oh, it says I can full screen with this. It full screens on the wrong window though. So, <laughs> damn. Damn it. Not All a right. piece of gig. All right, not the full screen in editing. Wonderful. All right. Uh, fantasy or modern? What are you talking about? Oh, the names? What? What? Wow, what a, what a, I've never seen such an option. What the How f- brave. <laughs> uh, How blase has that blaze blase? <laughs> blaze? Um, I guess to help, I mean, it's a choice. That's all there is to it. I guess some people were like, I don't like these, these fantasy names. La Alele? They, they're both so, like, <laughs> kind of creative though so i'm like i don't understand like what i'm choosing here like maybe if the names are modern names are like jeff steve tina christiana <laughs> christiana is weird and then the fancy names are just other languages la la, la lele is probably something in Polyne- some polynesian language and then miho of course is spanish <laughs> <laughs> so- <laughs> i like the idea that someone's going to be named miho so that is, te- that is tempting um, it means I'm his son, so I'm, I mean son. It's like, but that's a real world reference, unless Spanish exists in this universe. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm gonna do modern because I'm worried that the this might be too incomprehensible. Also, during the yeah, oh, Street Fighter stuff. That was louder than expected. Modern controls. Why was there a crash? I don't know. Car crash thinking. sound. Yeah, I heard it. Too. I was like, what? Okay, this taxi is very considerate. Fallon, Jimmy Fallon, get down here. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Oh, this is still very small for this resolution. Is that lightning from Final Fantasy XIII? <laughs> uh, it might be. <laughs> it's just lighter. Get my magazine and meet the driver. Oh, I can wasp. Oh. We're in the future. Wow. 16 by 9 aspect ratio and wasp. Wow. Oh, I can't wasp in this menu, though. Great. Oh, I can't change the buttons at all. I was gonna... Uh... Data? Okay, that's what I thought that meant. No, default sounds. Why? Fallon. Why would you name girl character Fallon? So, funny story. There is a male to female transgender MMA fighter named Fallon Fox that caused a ton of controversy for obvious reasons. Uh, so I was thinking of Fallon, I was like, I guess it's a real name. The only little Fallon I know is Fallon Fox, but 
And that's not to be controversial, I was just stating a fact. I'm not gonna say my opinions on it, but you guys, whatever, our, our, our fan base can go look it up if they're really cute. <laughs> that's the only time I've heard the name Fallon. All right, well, we've got standard RPG Maker shit where you can click on everything. Uh, rest, rest people, but not good. People want that for some reason. She said something about getting a magazine, but where the hell is it? All right, well, whatever, I'm just leaving. I need my magazine first. Oh my god, where is your magazine? I can't see it because the resolution's too low. Is there a drawer in the way bottom right of the bedroom? Yeah, I clicked on this. Oh, you did? Okay. Click on this mirror. Oh, I can't click on that we mirror. We gotta find it. Oh my god. Why would you start the game like this? No, is it that- what is that on the way right? It's like a basket, a laundry basket? I, I, I don't know if you clicked on that already, I can't remember. Bum, ba -dum, ba -bum, bum, bum, I have bum, the magazine. Alright, I got it. Oh, uh, what? I was gonna say, oh my god. I have to read my magazine? Is that I'll what you're say saying? Use the, use the item. <laughs> but but I'm not on the train yet, though. Yeah, yeah, I was like, I thought the whole point was you wanted to read it on the train. Like, this is, game's already not making sense. Okay. Okay. Great. Okay, that makes no sense. F That's not, that wasn't a magazine, that was the newspaper. Yes, boy. Kitty yelling at me. Uh -huh. sure, uh, oh, this is auto text. Oh. So these people are going to be great warriors? <laughs> I guess so. Magazine. Is that is that a European thing? Do they call the newspaper a magazine? Maybe. Yeah, maybe it's the same word. Yeah, run over oh, the kids! Yeah. Body. Whoa, it has a, a run over sprite. <laughs> wow, <laughs> or no. It's a lay on the ground sprite. It's a dead sprite. Yeah, there's usually dead sprites. Yeah. That was a horrible dream. Sorry, this I'm getting closer like... to my mic because of this cat that's attacking me in real life. This cat? looks very obviously an office building that has a moving background versus a train. <laughs> oh, yeah. Also, where's the door to her room? Unless it's on the, it's on the sides and you can't see it because the, the angle. Yeah. Kitty boy, why are you attacking me? Station Alpha Omega. Uh huh. So when do things that are relevant to like the plot of like fighting things happen? Oh, now you call it a newspaper. Yeah, I'm gonna have to hold spacebar now. This is straight makes sense. That's the hour. I started when you actually started, and all that reading in the beginning, and that probably took like three, four minutes. So we're at we're at nine minutes right now. Left. Okay. So fast, fast, fast. Whoa, that's a sexy outfit for a... Uh, spaghetti strap. For a... Uh, what do you call it? A receptionist. Right? Yeah. Oh, I can't hold spacebar. Ah, oh, this is a VXACE thing. You can't hold spacebar. You have to actually press the button multiple times. All oh, right. Did you see the thing that was boring? Oh, man. Not yet, not yet. Great. Boring things. Okay, isn't that not what I want? Why are you coming to West? Oh, I see. Thankfully, the NPC repeats the dialogue to tell me what I'm supposed to do. What is this? What is this uh, organization? Why do they have JRPG characters? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. And sexy outfits and things. We took a train here, so I thought it was more. Oh, whoops. Excuse me. like. Is this like techno fantasy? <laughs> so I saw the argument. That's good enough, right? Yeah, Sibling, everyone's dressed right? in fantasy, but then the the universe is it's techno fantasy, man. That's all there is to it, I guess. But it seems like our so far we're like in some boring jobs. So I don't understand. Jaeger. Jaeger. <laughs> I'll show you in a minute. Uh huh. Yes. So we're gonna have to fight monsters, apparently. Oh, jeez. It's like they knew that people would be just like mashing to get through the text. This is not the computer. Is this the computer? What's the computer? What? 
In the science lab. Oh my god. Apparently they don't have, like, network connections in the future. And they dress like they're in the Final Fantasy game. Uh, for some reason, the receptionist is coming with me. It's because she's hot. <laughs> <That's why. laughs> what goes on in this uh, <laughs> science lab? Uh, yeah, she is a receptionist. She said it just then. I know I'm not following the plot at all because we don't have time for this. Nonsense. She said it somewhere in the top left room. But that's that's saying it from the perspective of the player. She doesn't say you don't look at the room to your left and say, Oh, that top left room. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh oh. Hey, it's a puzzle. Some sort of puzzle. Oh. This is the whole like you go over it, yeah, you get one you have to figure out the, the route to do one. Oh, to do it in one to do it in one? Yeah, one continuous movement. Yeah, maybe. That's not, this that's one's not bad. Closer, so. Yeah. It's not this a bad one, idea. Uh, yeah, down, 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 down. You go to no, no. Oh, I guess either way works, actually. It doesn't matter. Yeah, this one doesn't matter. I assume that's the point. Is that seems <laughs> easy? Ow, that was loud. Mode. Oh, okay. It's like, why did no one else do that <laughs> until you got there? <laughs> Yeah, that's, like, that's like every game though. It's like we need you, the hero, to solve this puzzle, and it takes like twenty seconds. <laughs> and like, wow, no one else can figure this out. Oh no, the smoke detector is going off. God damn. Yeah. Go titties, yeah. Yeah, all these characters are so hot. It's crazy. Perfect. Everyone's twenty years old and hot. Oh. <laughs> yes, exactly. Huh? This, this is like, like a... the real world. This is like a reverse isekai. We summon someone into our world. Yes. Uh, I don't feel so good. Blah. What she is. She looks like a regular human. Human. Alpha Omega Headquarters. What a name for an organization. Seriously. I got four minutes left, by the way. <laughs> All right. We can extend a little bit because we spent like three minutes in the wave beginning. I think I started the time a little early, so I'm down to go over like a minute or two, but that's about it. Yeah, because of the cat because attack. The cat attack. I don't know where he is. Hopefully he's not causing more problems. He's uh, in the top left of your room. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out. Oh, I see. Ah, there's the Isekai. Oh, It's wow. like a group Isekai. Yeah, interesting. Hey! Uh-huh. Very dramatic music for people just talking. Yeah. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, she's like kidnapping them. Hornets! Oh, no. Here we go. Time to fight bees. Hornet prepares for battle. Let's plan what we'll do. Uh, uh huh. Yep. Okay. No, I'm gonna skip these. Okay. And this, and again, Waz doesn't work here. So I guess Waz is just a lie. <laughs> stab. Yes, stab. Stab. Also, what do you it got? Has, it has Power. the FPS uh, perspective, but your characters are kind of looking at you, and you can see most of their body. <laughs> it's kind yeah. of a weird hybrid. Maybe this isn't VX Ace, maybe this is XP, because I know XP did that. Uh oh. And I was like, this is the character you're using! And I was like, okay, thank you. These characters are identical. Uh, heal one, cure one, okay. And we're just gonna attack the same enemy because. Oh my god, the sound is so uneven! Why is it so loud? Yeah, oh this is really loud. <laughs> when you when you change the sound, was it just was it all sound or was it just the? Music I thought it said master volume, so that must be a lie too. Uh oh, I'll check after this. Wait, why is defend a skill? Or what does that mean? Or whatever. I just take half damage. Oh yeah, why is it under it? Yeah, oh, it was under skill. guard as well. So. Oh what the fuck? I don't understand yeah. that at all. Increases your armor. I don't know. Um. Yeah, just whatever. Yeah, this is good. 
timer says 136, but we'll, we'll give it two extra minutes past that. That's it. Low pens. I found low pens. Okay, I need to get the menu though, too, because I need to change these volume settings. Because they were a lie. Oh no. Uh huh. What? Huh? Okay. Alright. So. Yeah, master volume just must be a lie. I don't understand. Whoa! Oh, there it is. Yeah, I guess it doesn't actually work with the. The music just like stopped when I did that. Um. This is not working. Okay, well, I guess whatever then. Um. Just have to save. I guess I'll save. I guess I own this game for some reason, so. You know, maybe I'll want to play this game. I'll be like, whoa, whoa, so good. More bees. All right, well, I think this is one we can. And the sound is still too loud. Yep. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I might just alt F4 right now. <laughs> okay. I mean, the timer's at 8 seconds, and we don't have to give it the extra, the leeway minute. Yeah, let's not do that. It's just gonna right. be fighting bees. Uh, I don't care about fighting bees. Not the bees. Beyond <laughs> reality. No, no, not the bees. Uh, okay. Reverse isekai... I don't know how to spell this word. Where sci-fi people are... Are pulled into a fantasy world. Much talking and bees. There you go. Not um, the so, um, D mm, minus. Yeah, I was say, it's not. It's not even good enough to be average. I'd say functionality, lots of issues, but it wasn't beyond the worst thing ever. So yeah, I'll say D minus. I'll give it D minus. All right. Keep both it on the same page. I think, yeah. I think that was nice. reasonable enough. Um, you know, I'm sure if you play the game for 10 hours or something, there's some sort of value, blah, blah. But, you know, this format doesn't is even harsher than our usual format because, yeah. I mean, what are we going to do? Like, it's just fine. Or we're too nice in our regular format. <laughs> yeah. And this is how hard we should be. Yeah, because it's like, at the end of the day, I'm fighting bees and, like, the fucking options don't work like fuck this <laughs> it's yep. like so much talking just to be like to like Super what do you, what even is this world you're building it's like not even remotely interesting um, yep all right you ready for the next one sure all right bum, 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 bum. oh my god okay so this one we might maybe we should definitely cut it early Let's see, okay. Heroes of Time. If I remember correctly, okay. so this one I think I remember talking to you about at some point because like this guy was like, "Uh, I released all three games at once." I'm like, "Why? Why would you do that?" Oh yes, I do remember that. Yeah. So he has AI art for his uh, key art now, so that's cool. Uh, I assume this is AI art at least. Um. Yeah. Definitely assuming AI art now, because it definitely looks very AI here. I'm trying to remember the, the... I mean, I guess I'll see it when you bring it up, but I'm trying to think of the one that's... Was it the one that was saying part of these, you know, Time Walkers anthology or something? Yes, like, I think that's this. Okay. Let's see. It's like, hey, buddy, you haven't made it your name yet. Don't don't sit there talking about your anthology. Yeah, this game's a I prequel guess... to Heroes of Time, set a thousand years before the events of said game. That's it, yeah. Yep. <laughs> Anthology. Oh my god. So this game has a demo or something, right? Why did I add this game? Uh... <laughs> wait a minute! Where's the demo? Uh-oh. Can I not actually play this game? Oh. I don't have a demo installed, it looks like. Why did I add this game? I thought this had a demo. Uh-oh. Let's see if I can find this demo. I have a way of seeing if there was a demo that was released but pulled down. That might work. 
Yes, there was a demo at some point. Last update three minutes ago, no way. Uh, wow. No, uh, no way three minutes ago he took down the demo. Three minutes? <laughs> oh my god. He might have taken down the demo three minutes ago. What how are the, the odds? How the hell? He felt the wheel. <laughs> even we're not even streaming this. This is all recorded, so it's, there's no way of knowing. All right, well, I guess we're not playing that then. Goodbye. That's crazy. Yeah. That's hilarious. All right. Three minutes. Wow. Whatever, the game seemed like it was VXA garbage anyway, so. Maybe he's he's being smart and saying this is awful and actually self-selecting. <laughs> Maybe. You know, it's a funny thing is I've noticed that... Um, okay, this title is very difficult to fucking remember. Uh, I've noticed in researching some of these that a lot of them have been, like, taken down off of Steam. I'm not sure who's doing that. They're just like... I assume Steam's just like, fuck you, RPG Maker garbage games. No one's buying it. Take it down. It's Go possible, down yeah. They're like, it's not even worth the space. And there maybe there's some check. Yeah, like, if, in, if no downloads in, like, six months, it just automatically deletes it. Yeah, or some, like, complacency check where they just, like, take it down. And, like, if the dev doesn't, like, notice and complain, then they're just like, all right, cool, whatever. Because... Some of these guys honestly feel like aren't like they just put it up there and never pay attention again. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And it just takes up data space that, as much as they have, it's probably still relatively. It costs money. I mean, they should get rid of a lot of this stuff. All right. So, what is this game? Uh, why? Oh, I thought this was a different game for some reason. All right. Well, this game looks like it has some level of effort. Uh, perhaps AI art. That last game had the AI art, but it didn't. It didn't have a notice down here like you're supposed to have for your store page. Hmm. This one does not either, so maybe it's actual art. I don't know. Uh, but this game is full on free, so we'll at least be able to play this one. Hey. Experience the full game in 15 minutes. Yeah. It's early access, so I guess we'll have to be uh, kind. But probably not, because we're never kind. <laughs> <laughs> but we're not mean either. We're just we're just honest. Yeah. <laughs> this is just like, what would happen if someone plays your game, man? Or just like, like that VM Mortis yeah. game. Like that's definitely one that's like I don't trust that the dev actually played this game. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Exactly. How could you play that and go, oh man, I really like rolling a fifty percent die and saving the first X minutes of my game before I can start playing normally. Yeah, it's really dumb. Yeah. No, absolutely. Oh no, is this not MV? I don't know. I don't think it is. It's so loud though. Okay, now I can hear. Oh boy, this is a very familiar melody. Uh, Alright, you need to be able to see this. Uh, all right. So, AI art, babes. I'll take it. Okay, this is not MV. Damn. Damn the it. Good old font. The good old uh, generic JRPG or uh, RPG maker <laughs> font. Yeah. Whatever that is. I, I, I don't know. I'm sure. I, I'm sure it's a common one. But... Yeah. Hope you guys love seeing my gigantic mouse cursor when it comes on the screen because uh, <laughs> I can't do any. Oh, default sounds. Oh my god. Press F1. Oh, this game was free though, right? So we can, we can yeah. Resize. You can resize the game window pressing F6 or enter full screen F5. Well, let's see what that does. Nope, wrong window. Uh, so I can't do that. But I appreciate that that's, I guess, a plugin for VXAs. Uh, no. I don't need to be told the buttons, thank you. Oh, the year 903 of the Imperial Calendar was a year of great happenings for Valonia, centermost of the great continents. Kings were crowned, wars fought, and heroes arose. Wow, multiple wars in one year? Uh, far to the west, in an ancient kingdom of Versalia, King Antok Antokius lived... Oh, I, I, <laughs> oh, yeah, you're too busy reading it, you're, you're reading it out loud instead of reading it, the, just going... Yeah. 
Okay, okay, it's, okay. It, it says hand wavy as uh, somehow Palpatine returned. <laughs> yeah. Wars were fought. <laughs> they're coming, my king. Oh no, they're gonna reach us! They reached us! <laughs> oh, no, there actually are. Or are you? Get out of our way or meet your end. Ha ha, that's a lot of words. Holy shit. Uh, you're fools. I'm gonna defeat you or something. Oh, that was a pretty... This guy has some nice uh, assets for animation things. I think I know the asset pack. Doing some effects. Oh, whoa! It's music. Holy shit. Oh my god, this art is... At least it's unique art, but it's not very good. But at least it's <laughs> drawn. Yeah. Right? Not a dagger. Well, give I have them. a lot of skills. Generates TP. So why would I use attack? Alchemy. God, I have so many moves. Jesus. Uh, okay. Shift for target info. Wow! Look at that. Nice. Uh, oh right. <laughs> Sick. Cleave! Attack all enemies! Yep, this guy's the best. Spells. Let me double check my levels here. <laughs> uh, this is jamming pretty hard. Jesus Christ. Turn it down a little bit. Uh, no, I need something that hits all enemies. There you go. Wow, an extra button. Oh my god, these guys are so fucking strong. <laughs> they have so much HP. Wow, four they damage. Did no damage, yeah. This oh. is just a slog. This is a total slog. Wow. Alright, so this guy sucks because he can't hit multiple enemies. Oh, maybe he can. Maybe he can one shot a single target. Oh, okay. No. So AoE works. Uh, <laughs> no? Wow, these are long descriptions. Longer than mine. Amazing. Uh, uh, oh, okay, so it does hit all enemies. It didn't say that it would. Uh, Blade Storm! Hey. Five rounds. Annihilate! <gasps> Single enemy, Ow. no. More damage! That is funny, the middle. The, oh, I should have just done this. What is it? Middle carrier's TP and MP, that's pretty impressive. Yeah. Defeated! Yay! AoE attacks! Death, 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 death. No, defeated. They're defeated. <laughs> oh, second wave. Oh, wow. A wave of enemies. It actually is a second wave because it, like, restarted my shit. Uh. <laughs> frontal stab! Yes. Stab them in the front. My god, this music is just like. Uh, let's just do this, I guess. I don't know. No! Blade Storm! Oh, tanking? Become immune to all damage. Alright. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna do this. Okay, I didn't get to use this, so I guess I'll use it. He says a spell that says it does extreme damage to all enemies. Extreme. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, it did no dam- did mediocre damage, so it doesn't matter. Four damage, four damage! Okay, that effect didn't fill the whole screen. Oh my god, it <laughs> does so much damage! Alright, so... Garot. Bonus against sorcerers? Wow. Fence piercing damage requires stealth. Coming flex damage is not reduced by range. Slightly increased damage. Well, this one says high damage. So I'm gonna go with that. Uh, annihilate. But, it, but it's not extreme. <laughs> <laughs> Summons a beast of lightning to high damage. Oh. Enemies. Massive damage to one enemy. Oh, he's a boss or something, so. Oh wow! Yay! Oh, that was King Antokius. What more people? But we defeated the, the, the king. The waves. Uh, wow! This is 
place this has a lot of combat off the bat, I guess. I don't know. I can't vanish. I don't know. This guy's useless. He doesn't have moves to hit everybody. Therefore, he sucks. This guy has this. Wow, VXX has an extra button that I have to keep pressing. I keep forgetting. That says execute. So I have to be like, yes, do the thing I told you to do. <laughs> wow. Damage numbers. You can either use a move that does nothing or a move that kills them. I love how the numbers are so animated. There was that one that was 6,000 that had all the color. It went through all the color spectrum. <laughs> <laughs> that is so unnecessary. This also does the, the each damage is individual. It has to do like an, a chain of events versus just everyone's damage comes at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Look at, that. Look at the flickering colors. It's so good. Man, this yeah. guy is tough. Yeah, I have some plugins that I could use. I guess I have to buy that one. I'm thinking it has the wacky colors for stuff, but it's like uh, so unnecessary. I don't think that would fit the theme of my game. Yeah. So it'd be so colorful. Look at the neon lights. It does, arguably doesn't fit this. It, it seems kind of strange here. It's yeah, like well, fan, medieval fantasy, but also the light store at Home Depot. <laughs> 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 it's the light section of Home Depot. So <laughs> look at the look at the coloring on the uh, the fence post in the back. It's all colorful too. And then everything else is very muted, normal colors. But randomly, this game has super colorful rainbow stuff. Okay. Ba, 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 ba. Am I imagining something? Does this guy have infinite mana? Like, what the hell's going on with him? Yeah, he, he, just, he refills, yeah. Yeah, he gets I mean, 250 mana per turn, just for free. Maybe he's... is he super powerful? Is he, or is he maybe a temporary member? <laughs> yeah. For, for being powerful. Cassander. Not Cassandra. No, we, lo we ran out of all our cool moves. No. The only moves we want. Hooray. <laughs> we did it. So that was a lot of... I assume these guys are like super powerful and we're not going to get to play as them. Oh my god. Another... <laughs> Another text. Elsewhere storm. to the south in the land of Siridae. Siridae by the sea. King Kaganri... Seventh reign go, go, you're right time. passing off the reins of power to his eldest son, Sartharian. Dude, I was gonna say, okay, the girls, there was a girl in your party named Sindra something, and then there's Sartharian. This is straight up black dragons from WoW. <laughs> so they're, they're almost the exact same names. Your father also, this is my son. Oops, sorry. This, this right. is, yeah, story, story development in terms of text crawl or, or you know, narration dump, gameplay narration dump is pretty uh, low effort. <laughs> Just. <laughs> To tell people, this is a good story writing. This is why uh, this is like a, in in movies when they uh, don't have time to film everything, so they just hand wave off a bunch of stuff. <laughs> Not good. Okay. Hey, anyway, go ahead. Look, it's Liu Bei. Liu Bei. Yes. <laughs> and a bunch of samurai. <laughs> so it's like kind of Asia, quote unquote. Asiany is the term, the official term. <laughs> Applause. What the hell? Another oh my one? God! What the? And in Avalonia to the east, Avalonia, once the mightiest empire in all the land, in Avalonia, whose glory has long since faded away, there were no great kings nor great wars. In Avalonia, there was instead an academy, a university of sorts for nobles from all across the lands. Those ill content with only that which they could learn at court. Avalonia, its glory. Okay, and <laughs> oh, there were no great happenings in Avalonia that year. That is where this tale does begin. Oh, good. So you're saying this place is boring, so naturally that's where we're gonna... That's where we're going. Perfect. Okay, whatever. Oh, I can hold spacebar to make it go slightly faster. Uh-huh. Black screen. Is, is that the end of the game? Okay. <laughs> hey. And that's all for today. Why did the camera move like that? Alphonse... Whoa, huge bust. Holy shit. He's, yeah. <laughs> Takes up more than half the screen. Oh, whoops, that was like a tutorial or something. What? Look at these. Look at these. Uh, oh, my mouse turned off because I didn't use it for so long. 
Look at these these guys. They're default the default heroes. Uh oh. They're just hanging out. You don't belong here. Get out of here. All right. Cool. Um. Oh, always dashes on. Okay. Mhm. Mm Wait, what? Oh, for some reason I thought weekend was spelled. Misspelled. Uh. Okay. Well, after that dynamite intro, we're doing the thing where there's a big building and I'm lost. Uh, what's our time on this? Uh, three minutes. Three and a half minutes. Okay. Occupy yourself for the afternoon. Wow. Check the were there, the the were there room. busts before? Was he just the only giant bust, or were there no busts before? He's the only giant bust that I noticed. Okay, because the rest were just the portrait in the bottom corner. Yeah, why was his bust so large? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds funny. He had a huge bust. Yeah. Crazy. Um, is this not the west? Is this the west? Uh huh. Okay. This is, looks like a kitchen, though. What is he talking about? Uh huh. He's like, go to my. I need to go to my room. Uh, it's in the west. I need to enjoy my afternoon. Yeah, it's in the west. It's, it's like, in the left. It's to the top left. <laughs> yeah. But, oh, I'm back here again. What the hell? Wait, that doesn't make any sense. Didn't I get here from going up? Oh, I see. Okay. Uh... So, I mean, the west doesn't really make sense if, like, I can't figure out how to get to the thing they're talking about. Or where... Oh, whoa! Whoa. That's cool. Um, it doesn't quite work because my reflection exists on the rock, but it's pretty cool. That is a cool effect, yeah. Give it. I don't know why it doesn't work. I guess because I'm blocking myself. Well, if they're saying the reflection is purely down. Yeah. I wonder if they're doing like the old Duke Nukem technology where it's like there's just an NPC who follows your movements. That's what I was guessing, yeah. The transparent NPC. Yeah. Alright, we got one and a half minutes left. Um Yeah. Are you trying fine. to find your rooms? That's okay. fine. We'll just we'll just we'll just give up. Right. <laughs> <laughs> give up, damn it. Let that be a lesson to devs. Like Don't start me off in a giant confusing castle. Like, why do games do that? I don't know. Yeah. Let's go. Uh, Numina. Oh, wow. Okay, so this one's just going to be a bunch of talking, I think. This is one of the new games. We didn't score the last game. <laughs> oh, we didn't. All right. I already typed in a description here. Uh, lore, 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 lore. Uh... Yeah, I guess I should have assumed with a name like this that uh, it was going to be like that. It's a ridiculous name. Ah, so funny. Text crawl. Yeah, text crawl and then text crawl again. Text crawl. I had this idea for a joke game that I keep thinking about uh, doing for a jam or something. And one of the ideas would be that it would just bombard you with text crawls and annoy the fuck out of you. And you'd be like, come on, another text crawl? Really? Like. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Anyway, uh... But that I, was real in this game, lol. That was real. There was another text crawl, and then another text crawl. It's like, look at these people. Now look at these people with another yep. text crawl. I'm like, what does this have to do with anything? What's happening? Where's our character? Seriously. What's the story? Yeah. All these... Yeah, that's like a number one amateur writing, is just start... Just bombard your readers with proper nouns that are unique yeah. to your universe. It's like, okay... It's like, Let's see. Why do we need to know these things? Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna give it a D. I think I had time to think. Uh, I was thinking about D plus, but then I'm just grading them down for using VX Ace. I had pretty much the same exact thought process. Like, does it really <laughs> deserve a plus? Because it was so basic, and I'm like, no. Yeah. Uh, man, we're like grading the same. We're feeling the on the same wavelength. Uh, <laughs> Let's see. I'm trying to think. Text, you know what? I'll give it a D minus for all the text crawls. There we go. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. 
Fair yeah. enough. Fair enough. All right, so this next game, uh, Numina. I was gonna say it's fairly recent. Uh, I feel like this game kind of was a big deal. Um, maybe I don't know. It seemed like it made a big deal, at least among the forums or whatever. It has some reviews, so some people played it. Um, Seventeen dollars, pretty expensive. Uh, oh, Numina Part Two is a DLC. Oh, it came out. Oh, I didn't know that. How interesting. Uh, yeah, it keeps talking about Step Through the Fourth Wall, which is, um, not exciting to me. Uh, <laughs> it's like, I guess we'll see. We haven't been getting too much into these store pages. Yeah, this might be another one that's just... Well, it's RPG Maker. I think this one just has, like, another one that has just way too much of an intro. But we'll see. Let's just jump into this. Yeah, uh, why is there no options on the main screen? <laughs> always my problem. Crossbridge. Alright. So. That was a pretty cool intro. Let's, re let's reset it for that. Uh, hopefully it does the right thing. Yeah, it starts in wow. full screen. Wait a like second. Like a real game. That's the Mario star. <laughs> oh, yeah? Is that illegal? <laughs> so Look at this up intro, up. though. That's pretty I know, cool. I, I'm impressed somewhat. Yeah. No WASD, but it is at least full screen and 16 by 9. Theme works. So that's nice. Wait, is Crossbridge the DLC? Uh, This is... Download part 1 to continue planning. Oh, this is... Oh, I guess this is... So this first one is because uh, I'm playing the demo, I guess. Oh, okay. So I can huh. transfer my save. Uh, I don't know. Give them money for free. Yeah. And donate because do you just love the experience so much. Contact because you know you want to be part of this community, I guess. All right. So yeah, that was the other thing I noticed about this game is that it definitely has a lot of effort. So that's nice. Yeah. Uh. Nice to see effort. Uh, check my levels. Uh, yeah, I think levels are okay. Okay. Wait, did they remove the mouse? They removed the mouse. Okay. Always run. Open the options. Oh, now it opens the options screen. Okay. Action commands difficulty? Okay. I don't know what that means. I guess there's quick time shit. Language, text speed, normal. Uh, FPS lock. Okay. Audio. Well, it's too late for that. I already fixed the audio myself. There's a dyslexic <coughs> setting that's kind of funny. It's like knowing the, the font is kind of weird to read. It's oh. Like, Connects a lot, I guess. Oh, restart necessary. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I was curious. I know that there's certain things about the letters that like makes them hard to read. I guess. Uh, close. I guess. Yes. Very good. Uh huh. Long fade out. Whoa. Uh, but this isn't 16 by 9, why? Why was the splash screen 16 by 9, but this isn't? Hey, Jonathan, you finished your round unusually early. What? Uh, did you fall asleep on duty? Haha, -ha, you know I did. Alright, let's go. What, have you ever asked yourself why we were hired as guards? What do you mean? We're jobbers. I don't know. It's some sort of temple, isn't it? Why didn't he's here anyway? To be honest, I'm more comfortable without knowing what's going on inside these walls. It's easy money. Mother's medication isn't cheap. Wow, they don't have health care in the yeah, fantasy I was gonna say. world, apparently. Is your mom have diabetes? <laughs> insulin? Magic insulin? <laughs> fantasy insulin? Yeah. Not sure if these people realize that you know, 
back then, you would just die. <laughs> yeah, that's true. If you, had, if you had health problems, you'd just be dead. I hope this herb, this, this quote-unquote doctor found works, because if it doesn't, <laughs> and it probably wouldn't. Yeah. Walkity, walkity, walk. Come on, Jonathan. What are you doing? What are you doing? We gotta have adventure. This is like a video game that's happening. Let's do it. Oh. Bodied. Oh, it's just like music stingers. Like, <laughs> professional. <laughs> Boom. Whoa. Now the question will be, will this get freaking uh, YouTube copyright strike for this music? Oh. Quick now. Dun, 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 dun. They got Shayna, what should we do? Follow me. They yeah, are lots of just, just more characters, lots of characters. Those two guards dead. Oh, I'm playing as someone else now. Uh-huh. Wow, I'm so Can't fast. even inspect their body, can't even say it. they're dead. Nope, just run them over. Damn it, they're dead. Oh, okay. Don't you dare go any further. You won't stop us. Oh, fighting. Oh, right. Oh, it's a time game, eh? Hey. As soon as they land a critical hit. No, not default sounds. Why would you have default sounds? Look at the party placement, so it's... Like, two people in the top right, two people are behind a wall bottom left next to... Or middle right. I don't think they're part of the fight. Oh, they're not. Okay, maybe not. Yeah, maybe they're just... Oops. Oh, I guess that was bad. I hit the actual shadow. Stone throw? These guys just gonna throw rocks. Yeah. So that's the okay. I think that's a that blink. So I think that's a crit. Oh, do nothing. All right. He really got you there. Oops. Oh, too late again. Yeah. Yeah, that one's critting. That one's a little generous. Yeah. Okay. This guy's not fighting for some reason. Oh, I was like looking at something else. Oh my god! <laughs> You're killing me. <laughs> Honestly, I want to see it once. That there, one was that perfect. One's super clean. Yeah. That was Oh, I didn't get to see it. <laughs> the circle. Move aside! Fucking hey. music. Jesus Christ. Seriously. <laughs> Something is happening! I People thought... are doing things! He just rocketed it away. <laughs> wow. Bop, 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 everyone. Bop, 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 bop. Hop. I have a little hop that they do to show their time. It's so good. Yeah. Ridiculous. Surrender for someone. Who's, who's talking? What's happening? Too late. Oh. Uh oh, he got body. Okay. Oh, it's the blood. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, he's dead, I guess. You killed him. This music, Jesus Christ. What? Why did he jump into the laser? <laughs> kind of funny. This is like oh. really intense, but it's hard because it's uh it's fucking 2D sprites on a set <laughs> perspective. So it's like so supposed to be super epic, but it's just kind of comical because it's yeah limited by the engine. I mean, it would at least have more effect if the art style matched the yes. music style. This is true. Oh, I guess we get to play now. They got away. All right. Oh, it's weird that the text boxes like move. I guess I can't run yeah. during this. Whoa! It's shifting. The thing is shifting. I guess it's parallax mapping. And that's an event. Um. Okay. Weird camera movement. Oh, I guess we hid. This guy must have gotten, like, some stock movie music, or something. Because there's, oh, there, you can yeah. just buy music like this out there. I was going to say, yeah, it's probably... It's just, it's just so funny, because it sounds like it's meant for, like, a movie or a trailer or something. Yeah, it's an epic thing. Hey, where'd they hide? We'll find like them in the water or around the corner. Something. Oh, there is that a hole there? No. Oh, okay, yeah, that's what it what? was. What? They're I inside they're the just... wall somehow. 
What do we do now? I don't know, person. This person doesn't have a name. Caroline. What determines why a no a person's name or don't know their name? I'm going to find the others. Whether he wanted to think of it, whether they're going to be important later, I don't know. And then whether he felt like putting one in. But it's the person I'm playing as. Yeah, 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 that's true. Oh, restricted menu access, okay. Oh, is it? Okay, excellent. Listen, you need to go on this. <coughs> go on this linear path. Wait. Ooh. Someone's there. Oh, it's in shadow. Look at that. But they have a lantern. That is, like, not lighting it up very well. Yeah. Are you sure they're down? More new characters. Yep. Are you sure? <laughs> why are you doing these people? Nothing. We just need their help. Their help? Then why do you hold them like prisoners? Too many questions. Don't be so harsh. He's very fully concerned. Let me reassure you, this is for the greater good. Yeah. Fascism. All right. Oh, <laughs> yes, more murder. <laughs> he became such how long until he would have told the other guards? Ezio. We're not murderers, damn it. Don't you understand that? Uh, it seems like you are murderers. Ha, 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 ha. Murder. You may be talented, Ezio. That is why you are here. But if you continue to disregard my orders, you will feel the consequences. Yes. Just break my orders ten more times. And that'll be it. Too many times. <laughs> Damn it, he doesn't know. He doesn't have. The, they're like disappearing as soon as they get to the edge of the screen. He needs to like extend the level out. So yeah. That they can like walk off screen properly. I guess that's just me being a dev and noticing, noticing things. Effort. Oh hop. no! It's this. It's the hopping, the dodging, the pink lasers. God, that fucking music stingers! It's <laughs> just making me <laughs> laugh because they're so like. They sound like they belong in a horror movie or something. Yeah, this is like a parody you do to make fun of a movie that, like a parody movie that knows it's not epic but plays it as a joke. <laughs> this feels like oh. Chanting. What's happening to me? What's happening to anything? Yeah. I'm skipping text, but it's like we keep introducing characters and killing them before we know what's going on. Yep. It's the prologue. And now this is happening. This would be creepy if it wasn't a bunch of uh, RPG Maker sprites. Yeah. <laughs> They look like little, like, beamy babies. Whisper, whisper, whisper. Well, they're vined. Apparently that ended. I don't know if I press spacebar at some point and cause that to skip like that. Uh, Noesis? I guess that's the chapter name? Yeah, that's one. what I'm guessing. Wow, okay, so now we have another new character. Whoop. More new character. And now we get to the most interesting character, a person who is completely unrelated to the story who doesn't want to fight. Yes, uh, like, a farm boy who is forced to adventure but doesn't want it. Yeah, uh, what's happening? Okay. Some of the timing on some of these scenes. Aura, why are you already up? I couldn't sleep. I'm just too ex What? Like, what is? what does this have to do with what we just saw? He even looks like a, a cool JRPG main character. Some little <laughs> boy with, like, bright eye with a headband. Just like a total bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, or, the temple. Hooray. Whoa. Oh, I guess they're whoa. hugging. Animated. You can actually see your arm up. It yeah. Doesn't. It's cool. Whoop! Oh, is that loop already? 
But what about all the murder? Alright, now we're in this boring JRPG village where... Always gotta have a cliff edge so you don't have to animate more... <laughs> more, uh... ground... Yeah. elsewhere. Pretty cool transitions with the lights and stuff. I wonder if this is MZ. Because it has a... particle effect or whatever you call it thingy. Uh, okay. What? Whoa! Blinked, I assume it's because it's loaded another level. Trying to fade from white and stuff. We're almost there, Aura. The Temple of Clouds isn't far from here. I've still got plenty of energy. Well, I don't. Please talk faster. Please talk less, I mean. we got three minutes left. <laughs> this nameplate thing doesn't work. It doesn't work, yeah. It's cutting off as the P in his name. There was a Faye earlier, and it says Bev. It looks like Bev on the... <laughs> when they're talking. And it's like not even, like, disappearing at the correct timing? Yeah, it appears... I don't know. Yeah. It appears like it disappears after the box is fully closed, which I think is not right. It doesn't feel right to me. It feels I like it should close that. as soon as the box starts closing. Yeah. This is fun, the best probably though of the games we've played today, which isn't saying much, but yeah, it does just, seem the most functionally correct. Oh, there's no diagonal movement. We have all this like. Oh no! All that inventing and work and music and no diagonal movement. Yeah. And so, I guess this is parallax mapping, because this is, like, look how big this collision is. It's fucking, because you can't. Oh, because, like, yeah, the corners, the diag, the... Yeah, because you don't have tiles. pixel movement, so... Jesus, those half tiles, man. Might as are pretty much out of a zero tile. Uh, I'm gonna not talk to you people. Yeah. What? Aura. A little dizzy. Overexert yourself. It's because we're in the fucking mountains. There's no air. Not enough air. Uh oh. <laughs> Another new character is following us. And they look <laughs> like a regular person. Wait, is this like a 5D? Like, what am I looking at here? Yeah, do you go under that? But oh yeah, there's a little bit of a break. Yeah. Well, oh, it teleports to the other side of it. You can't go under it. Like visually, it's there's a little break you can see. But what the I hell? I guess it has to load it. It has to load a different zone. Oh, you can I see. see. The edge. It's a little bit bolder. Barely. I couldn't. I couldn't see that this was. Yeah. Okay, I see. Yeah, this would have been an impressive trick if you didn't have to do a locate player thing. <laughs> yeah, that's shifty like that. Um, is this like what? It's a doom. You, there's damn. no uh, no vertical axis. <laughs> yeah, this is always a problem with like parallax mapping. Is you're like, oh man, I'm gonna do something like this, but then you realize like, wait, like how does a player go under a thing they came from? Ouch. And you can't do that. I've seen other RPG Maker games do it, but like the way they do it is like, <sighs> well, I guess what you'd have to do is this block here that I'm walking on. Yeah. Hmm. It needs to be an event that's like under players as I'm walking here, but then when I walk over here, it causes a trigger that makes the block go over players. Oh yeah. yeah. And so like you have to change like the collision and stuff. The shadow also doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Uh, yeah, it catches the side of the mountain as if it's a straight line. Yeah. Well, we got t you got ten seconds. So. <laughs> <laughs> By the way. So. Oh, shit. Sean. Oh. No, oh, my cloak. My cloak. <laughs> yeah, let's continue. Will yeah, we see the one more thing? Yeah. More no. gameplay, perhaps. Either that, or we try another game. But they're all your characters are now. They're all nah. top of each other. I think this will be the last game, actually. I think so. Yeah. I think you're right. Whoa! Yeah. All right. Cloud. That fog loaded in after the map. I should probably like cover up your pop in like that with fade in commands but you know this demo might not be like the latest version of the game I don't know 
But, you know, that's... I didn't have to, like, be nefarious to find this demo. It's still just readily available on the store page, so... Yeah. That's kind of what... You, I assume that's why a lot of people remove their demos, because they just, like, get tired of, like, updating it. Yeah, for those the zero people who play their game. <laughs> yeah. I can understand that. Oh, there she is again. Another character. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, timer sure is up, so whenever you find a good stop. Sure is fun to walk through all these pretty maps and do nothing. Oh, I can't even hold spacebar to make this go faster. Uh-huh. Okay. Wow, great. It forced me to do that slow pan. You don't understand. Look how pretty my level is. Oh, hold spacebar works because it's MV, I guess. Cool. Or MZ. I don't know. One of the two. Boy, oh boy, the audacity of this developer to have these slow-ass scenes like this. Yeah, look at the story. It's so cool. It's like he's he's walking slowly because he's unsure. It's like, really now? He's going to walk across the entire screen at that speed. Oh, am I controlling my character? Okay. Hi. Hi. Uh, what do you mean I? What does I mean? I'm pressing spacebar. Oh, this thing? Okay, that was... Why would you draw attention to that? There's no reason. I don't care. Steal the orb! I don't know what the story is, but let's steal the orb. That's the fun thing about playing RPGs as a kid. Like in the old days when they had like... You know... Shit you could do that would just auto-fail the game. You spit, oh, orb, I'll take it! And, like, not paying attention to any of the dialogue about how, like... And the know, world ended. <laughs> the world ends, or you get killed immediately by the guards. Yeah. Why are these people fighting me? <laughs> the world learned of eternal darkness. <laughs> yeah, I think Breath of Fire 4, which is relatively... I mean, it's an old game by modern... It's a PlayStation 1, like, late PlayStation 1 title, but I think it had that. At the end of the game, you can choose to betray your friends, and then it's like, <laughs> the world knew eternal darkness. Yeah, all right. <laughs> or you, or you fight the last boss, right? I don't know if something's gonna happen. We might just have to cut our losses here. We saw one fight, and then a bunch of people died. To something, something happened. Yeah. Which, funny enough, I don't think if I was even paying attention, to this text would make any sense. Because I like watched someone play this game. I think. Uh -oh. Oops. I pressed spacebar too quickly. Did you pick something? I, I picked pick something. It. There was some sort of option that came up. What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter? What yeah, time mean? to fight things. Oh, Ooh. that was cool. Spiral staircase. That was really cool. Don't worry, I'll go in this dungeon and fight monsters. That's the solution, I'm sure of it. Or just tumble down the stairs, that's good too. Has there been any actual JRPG combat yet? Yeah, just the one tutorial one where one. I had to... Okay. I'm trying to remember. I had to hit the circle and I missed it every time. Oh, that's this game. Oh my god, the merging. <laughs> I, I'm like, like, we played three games and it's like, I'm just like in my head, I'm like, oh my god, it's this game. Okay, I want I want one. I want to see one successful story before it comes to the out of curiosity. Okay, so I think these options don't matter. Hey, you. You didn't even say what I said. Oh wait, I see. This is the fourth wall stuff. I think. Because I'm me yelling at this person, I guess. A ghost. Maybe. The main character here. Which is weird, because I play as him, but now I'm... Uh, I don't know, I'm playing a video game. Where's that option? Oh, I am 
petroleum. Does this... Oh, I have a screen... Ooh, look at that. Little animation. It's nice and fast, though. Which is nice. It knows. Wow, so many, so many things. Alright. Look at that. Skills. He has skills? Sword dust, Bruce Morale. He's the same Boost skills morale. as that person. Uh, let's get one random encounter. Uh, Maybe. If not, then whatever. <laughs> why is this collision different? Yeah, I can't even open this door. There we go. Guns! Okay, this must be MZ, because that's uh, particle effects. Trap dungeon arena. Go, 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 run! Run into monsters! Go this way! Okay, these are all kind of the same thing. Couldn't tell him. Get a grip! Steal! Steal the gem! Oh my god, I get a name. Look how long my name is! Jesus. Uh, so, can I type? Limousine riding, jet flying. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh god, it's like, that's how many letters you get. Obviously that's still too long, but you know what I mean. You gotta take more Ric Flair. Uh... Or you can actually spell out the numbers, don't like it. Actually, spell out every word. Versus using a pound sign. <laughs> oh, man. Should I be Scott Steiner? Scott, can I fit Scott Steiner in here? Oh, it's Steiner! That's not space? How do I do space? Oh, dude, I'm a genetic freak. Oops. How do I get a space? I don't get spaces? I guess I don't get spaces. No. That's too much fun. You can't do that. Uh, I can fit this whole name. Oops. Damn it, you freaking I'm not normal. <laughs> Scott. My name is Scott Steiner. <laughs> A great name, isn't it? <laughs> it's got only Scott Steiner to make fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, go, go, go. We're already way over time. That's fun. Let's, let's get to the next thing. Like, yeah, yeah. Alright. Too much. A moment of actual, like, fun and interactivity. Yep. Oh! Beam she sword. has a lightsaber. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Like, I was gonna say it's a stab. It looked like a stab after I looked at it before. But initially it looked like I like a beam sword. Oh, well. I guess and she's I like, a oh, it's Easily talked her out of it. Dude, si yeah. Also, Simon says window above you. <laughs> do 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 do. <laughs> Gotta remember the colors. Okay. We did it. Maybe. Do I get to do things? Oh. Yeah. I don't know how much. This might be one of those things where it's sunk cost fallacy. Maybe we just. Yeah, yeah, say yeah, it. It might, yeah, I might just keep doing story, story, story. Yeah, it just never yeah, ends. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, either way, it's fine. Whatever. I'm sure. I'm sure nothing different would happen. Just yeah. The the, uh, the critical hit color. That's it. The combat system didn't seem particularly interesting. I already looked at this guy's skills, and he just has like attack, and this doesn't even have a description, and increase attack damage. So it's kind of like whatever. <laughs> whatever. Oh man, I gotta save in case I uh, feel like doing this again. Yeah, back whatever. To this. whatever. Um, no, me nah. All right. Uh, so this definitely gets some kind of grade for uh, having effort. Um, yeah. Way too many cutscenes, and I really get the impression that they're incomprehensible. It's just like too many characters and shit happening. I guess you have to like just like play on through the game to like find out what all this crap is, but it's like, man, I just don't care about yeah. the character I'm playing as, so that's kind of the main thing. Like, you're not, it's, that's, that's always my thing that I harp on. It's like, what is my character, like, what is my character's motivation? Like, what is my motivation? Yeah, it's like the same problem as that, you know, the game with all the lore. It's like, you're still just kind of wasting my time. I mean, I guess it's building intrigue and stuff at least, but 
it's still kind of wasting my time if I don't get what I need out of the story, which is, who is my character? What is my motivation? What's going on? Like, my motivation so far is this guy's lost in a completely unrelated temple? Yes. I get. Yeah, exactly. I, I, I didn't feel it either. And, and I think being harsher, you know, over time, uh, this may have gotten us, you know, in the C range before, but now I'm just so over the whole, like, super generic. The timed hits is cool, whatever, but it's just generic JRPG, RPG maker, even if it's with eventing and stuff. It, it, it kind of shows the limitations of the, the medium because, you know, it's like super dramatic music, daring escape, and oh, it's just... Yeah pixel sprites doing their like their walk animation a little faster and like hopping around because the guy just you know you don't see like a jump animation they just kind of move the sprite and it's implying they're diving out of the way and then they all look like beanie babies and it's kind of it's more comical than it is serious so yeah. <laughs> uh, but I will say obviously a lot of effort or I shouldn't say a lot but for an RPG maker game a decent amount of effort so I'm thinking a D plus plus D plus plus. All right. It's like Sounds I can't justify good. C, but but a lot of you know decent amount of effort was put in. So yeah, I guess that's true. I it's wanted to give it. That a C. Wanted to give it a C minus minus, but that would be. <laughs> this is I guess a leap of faith. Maybe I'll give him a leap of faith. The C minus yeah. minus. Yeah. Don't don't use my words too much for your own. Keep try to let's try to keep our opinions. I know we we joke about <laughs> it. That we do influence each other here and there, but it's like just imagine I didn't, you didn't hear my score yet. <laughs> <laughs> be unbiased as possible i mean i was thinking about c minus minus but i was just like also thinking like how boring is this game though that's kind of my end result of why i was kind of leaning towards d plus plus oh, okay uh, and to be fair those two scores are right there you know one right next to each other so yeah so i'm giving them c minus okay. minus right. uh basically on faith that you know more gameplay happens and maybe it's somewhat interesting um but that's a leap of faith I guess I guess I'll give that to them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but there's a lot of effort, so that's cool. Good effort. Thank you for your effort. One of these days yes. we'll play a game where the effort is put uh, squarely on game design. Hopefully. Uh, yeah, exactly. Like if you want to cut out a lot of story, a lot of the that, that's fine. Like come up with game design that's actually engaging, or cut down a lot of the eventing, all that. You can do that. You can choose to spend your time on, you know, game design. Have, like, cool shit. Have a bunch of... Because this game obviously seems like it has mods to me. Because, like, the name box is wrong. And, like, I don't know. A lot of the presentations seem, like, not not possible in RPG Maker without some kind of modification. Yeah. And exactly what you said. I. It, that's kind of the problem we see a lot of these games. That it's, it's this... You can tell they, they were trying to do their epic story, they do inventing, they do effects, they do all this stuff. You can tell by the words that you're reading that they're supposed to be, you know, intense, but you kind of play it and you're like, man, all this effort into the the non-gameplay side of this video game. And that's usually what, because again, the limitations. I mean, I know that the people don't push the limitations of RPG Maker enough, and that's kind of one of our critiques, you know, why we kind of start this channel, but at the same time, that's, that's also just part of it, right? It's, they go, well, I can't all the gameplay I got in my mind for this is going to be generic JRPG, but I want to put the effort into this game, so where do I put it? Like, oh, ep an epic story, and it's, I guess. But that's, like, the only place they can think of it for a lot of these games. Yeah, and the thing it's is, to be honest, that. like, you know, none of these people are good enough at, like, story. I mean, you know, you can have all this, yes. like, time and effort in eventing and coming up with lore and stuff, but that doesn't make for a good story. Like, you need to have... It's, it's, it's such a uh, either you have or you don't kind of thing of like gripping the player and stuff, gripping the audience, making and, and things that are interesting happen. <laughs> and, I, and I kind of said it before, and I feel the medium, obviously, you know, some people probably disagree. I'm sure some people watch, you know, these Beanie Baby sprites and, you know, these, these like South Park style animations and go, oh my God, I'm so immersed because they can do it. But for me personally, there's only so much, and I've told you this before, like without facial expressions, without animations beyond moving sprites and stuff like that. I, the story could be the best story ever written, but it's, if it's presented in this way, I just won't feel the impact. Yeah. And you could, if you could somehow take the exact same, it's the, in theory, let's say if someone made it, you know, the greatest story ever in RPG Maker, 
using this and somehow some in like some alternate magic AI universe, whatever. Someone had technology to, to port the story over and make it an epic, you know, one and a half hour, two hour film. And it was like considered one of the greatest, you know, action movie, adventure movies of all time. It doesn't matter because the, the original display of it being an RPG maker, it, it just it doesn't hit the way. Um, I just I can't separate it like that. I, I feel that the medium is too limited in storytelling so that even if you have the best story ever, it just won't be presented that well, to be completely honest. That's how yeah. I feel about RPG Maker and the base assets and all that stuff. Or not, you know what I mean, like in just using the system as it is. Yeah, because so. potentially you could replace... Cause, I mean, obviously, seeing all the modding and stuff that they do to make to get the presentation that they have here. Um, the problem is, I think, sticking to like the aesthetic of RPG Maker. Like, if they... I'm sure that's because a lot of their art is either stock art or default that they've just been editing to kind of like minimize costs and stuff, which is understandable. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if you if you had like a actual budget to like make something that looks cool, you could you could do that in RPG Maker. It is possible, but I think I talked about this before. It's like at some point you hit the threshold of well, if you have a lot of budget and you have a lot of team members, then why are you using RPG Maker? <laughs> that's kind of exactly. that's kind of the problem. It's not RPG Maker's fault that you just kind of level out of <laughs> using the tool. Yeah, you grow out of it, quote unquote. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, I don't know. Um, I, I, it was really funny to use that movie music to try to sell how dramatic shit was, but it just made me laugh because yep. it just looks so silly. It looks like South Park trying to like doing it as a parody. You know? Yeah, yeah, that is the problem. Um, so yeah, I guess that's maybe that's part of why I kind of have a little less, you know, moments of less seriousness in my game because it's like, I don't know, it's it's still at the end of the day gonna look janky and feel like yeah. a video game. So it's like, eh, maybe I shouldn't be super serious because I don't think it'll land. Yeah, I honestly, you know, if I were to do an RPG, that's how I would do. If I was going to write a story, I would either keep it very simple and try to make the gameplay good, or I would, yeah, make it almost a, a self-aware, you know, dra dramedy, <laughs> to be completely <laughs> honest. Because I, I don't think it's, it's, for the reasons I said, I just don't think it's worth it trying to make an actual, seriously well-written story in RPG Maker. It's just, yeah. I get people had the suspension of disbelief maybe back in the day. I don't know. Yeah. But, I mean, it's theoretically yeah. possible. They could also do the approach of, like, some old either old or indie CRPGs I've played like uh, they just hit you with like a wall of text and like you know they do they do novel format they describe like what the person's doing and what their facial expressions are and stuff it doesn't yes. doesn't try to actually present what's happening so it's like you know a novel that you can move around and talk to people in basically and you know that's less effort <laughs> because you don't have to do all those animations and stuff but maybe that's more effective I don't know it's hard to say, yeah, because I, I get what you're saying, and I almost agree with it. But I, I try to, you know, I was thinking about that in, uh, in Fallout Two, when there's like the there was the restoration project where a bunch of cut content got remade, and you can kind of tell what is was a restoration project because the guy who made, it, I think his name was Killip, uh, he, when you talk to people, it constantly puts parentheses for novel style. You know, you see a man with a scar across his face and a yeah. grimace or whatever. You know, and then. Because the original game didn't do that very much uh, in the dialogue. So when you see these giant, like, bracketed or parentheses text, it's like, <laughs> oh, this is a restoration edition. <laughs> so, and, and I think for there, it kind of works because it does establish well that, you know, it kind of comes down to the whole vibe of, is this the, the, the medium kind of, do you, did you establish the feeling that the fill-in should be there, right? So, for example, in Fallout, you can't see the faces... It's a lot of sprites. And then the game already has a little window in the bottom left that that describes things to you in the world that you hover over. So you kind of already have in your mind the whole like reading thing. But, and then you look at the things, they all have good detail, they're all proportioned normally, they're just small. The sprites are just small in the game and you're just at a, at a, a God's eye angle, whatever. So you, you know, so it doesn't look comical. It just looks like you're looking at it from really far away. So I can't see the facial expressions. So that's how I, I felt like, okay, I can, I can let this go. But then you look at this JRPG stuff and it's, everyone looks squished because they're the JRPG sprites and they all look like Beanie Babies, as I keep saying. And, and then it's the camera's closer and then there's actual beams of energy flying around. And so in your head, <laughs> you're like, this is, this is supposed to be a visual storytelling medium. 
So if you just start text dumping a bunch of stuff, I don't know if it works. You have to find the right balance. It's hard, but yeah, it's just a thing that yeah. you have to figure out as a as a developer. So yeah, I guess I guess we'll see more of my eventing when we cover my game again because I do have a new version out, and I'll see how you like the little quests that are in the next zone. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Uh. But yeah, I guess I've been trying to do it a little bit. I, I've always had a very, uh, at least, especially for this game, a very, uh, I don't know, not, I don't know if streamlines the right word, but just, just get to the meat of the interaction, and not, which I assume some people will hate because it's like, oh, there's not enough, like, depth or unnecessary detail. I'm just like, nah, here's the thing that happens when you talk to this person, right? Let's get to the, <laughs> what the interaction is, what's the quest. Yeah. What is, what does each person want? That's enough for me. Um, so that's what I'm doing. Like, that's yeah. what I care about. Just put what I care about in the game. Put how does this affect, like, what's the dressing of this, you know, go to place, shoot bad guy. Like, why? That's the whole point of this. Yep. Um, as opposed to, like, I don't know, try to write a fucking novel with a giant wall of text. Be like, oh, now, now, now that you know. 5,000 words of text, now you can play the game. No. <laughs> Don't yeah. do that. Indeed. <laughs> it's not, not, yeah. It, it's just, that's a part of game design, how to present information. It's not great. So. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, I think we should, or I think we're ranting a bit. This episode's yeah. probably going on really long. So we're definitely, we're definitely ranting way too much. We're not even supposed to have like a wrap-up section for these. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, we've reviewed all the games that we're gonna do, and uh, we got four, which is pretty good. One of them had to be skipped because apparently there's no demo. Uh, whoops. Three minutes before recording time, potentially. Potentially. I don't know if that's what that means, but that would be insane coincidence yeah. if that was the case. Indeed. Um, but yeah, all right. I guess we'll see you guys next time. Yep.